Oh, it's amazing. I can, I feel a lot freer now. Um, I'm not scared to speak up anymore. Um, I go out all the time now with my friends. Um, I'm hardly in my room now, which is really weird. <laughs> um, and I actually enjoy like going out. Like I, if I want to go out with my family now, rather than not wanting to before. Because you were staying in your room, now you go out. I've had Reiki healing, I've, I've tried meditation, I've tried therapy, I've tried CBT therapy, I've tried everything and nothing worked. And you've had that all these years? All these years. Trying different things? Absolutely everything under the sun. Did you feel you were stuck with this depression feeling? I did. I literally thought this was going to be it forever. And you felt this dark feeling because of it? I felt lost. I felt, I felt like this was this was the, this was it. This was this is my whole life for the rest of my days. Yeah. And just. But now, what's life like for you now? Tell me. Brand new. Brand new. And not just only have you had a makeover and changed how you look and you feel confident in yourself. Yes. Absolutely. You're socialising. Yes. And you met someone special. I have. So. Um. Yeah, I used to get butterflies. I used to have a really big fear, fear of um, like hospital appointments, anything to do with doctors or uh, medical appointments because I had really bad health anxiety. Uh, I used to think that something bad was always going to happen to me. Um, I went to a concert, which is quite a big thing for me. I didn't panic. I actually enjoyed it. Um, I don't have, I haven't had a panic attack probably since our second session. Mm -hmm. um, I don't get this sense of dread all the time. I do have regular hospital appointments and I've not had any fear. Because you're pregnant at the moment, so you've had to go quite a few times into hospital. So um, your family were surprised, weren't they, weren't around the hospital appointment? Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, my husband was just really shocked that, that I was sat in the waiting room and I wasn't jigging my knees, I wasn't holding his hand, I wasn't taking deep breaths or drinking gallons of water to try and calm myself down. Um, I didn't rush through the corridors or rush to get away. Um, I didn't cry or, you know, all the things that may have happened previously. Um, I didn't panic and when he was holding it, he held my hand at one point and he said, I can't believe your palms aren't sweating. Um, so yeah, even he was shocked. Yeah. Um, I was just amazed by the result of that. It was such a powerful ch uh, shift change in my mood um, that I remember waking up from it or when it came to an end thinking I wanted to just get out and, and, and enjoy my life and leave straight away. The other thing was um, you could, you were dizzy. You said you were having panic attacks and getting dizzy when you tried to go out as well as your stomach. Yeah. yeah, as soon as I knew I was going out or planning to go out, I was really dizzy and I was sweating up and I'd try and drive and I could feel like it would be dizzy. Before you even left the house? Before I even left yeah. the house. Okay. So in three weeks of therapy now, you started to feel better straight away, didn't you? Yeah. Within a couple of days, yeah. it was so different. After the first time you met me, then a couple of days, everything started to change. So should we go yeah. through all your changes that you... Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Tell me about it. What's happening? Um, now I'll go out. Um, I'll take the children out. I won't even think about going out. Um, I'm up bright and early. Um, I'm back having a laugh with the family again and not thinking of the dread of it all. Yeah. You've been trying new um, things. You've been going everywhere. Where have you been going? Um, I've been, I would never go on the motorway now. I go, I'll drive on the motorway. Ikea is like a big thing. I would never go in Ikea. I've shopped in Ikea. Because that's the one-way system. Yeah, so let's get, let's get it clear why you can't go to Ikea before. It's because of the one-way system and getting trapped and can't go you back. You can't get out. Yeah. yeah. And now you went to Ikea? I went to Ikea and properly just mooched around. And supermarkets? Supermarket, I haven't been for, to a supermarket for ages. I used to do my online shopping online. Um, and now I go to every single supermarket. And browse, not not. And browse. Even if I don't need nothing, I will go just for to get out and have a mooch around. 